Blog Talk Radio. Yo, we back, man. God first entertainment, born winner. Let's do it. My mind was clawed, I went through withdrawals, hoping I won't fall, dodging death like I played on salt, I just scratched and clawed to the top, I was steady climbing, I was steady grinding, digging deep, like a surf of diamonds, I'm just saying, Simon, I bet Simon said, mama called me Teddy, slept on me like beds, lyrics sick, like they out the meds, hanging off a ledge, I stack paper like TMT, TMT. they ain't seeing me. me, well I guess they are, cause they watch me like TMZ, yeah. grandma died, but she off in heaven, ain't no need to grieve, yeah. fast life. life, you would think I played on need for speed, speed. but that my past, so lead a path with past thing with last thing. I had bullets flying like they had wings. I had to cut them snakes off and now my grass clean. You say you hip, man, stop, boy, you pass green. I speak the truth and tell you what it is. Until you fake, you can't fake being real, for real. I done been through the struggle, I been through the pain. I done been through a lot, but you see that I changed. So keep sleeping on me. Keep sleeping. Yeah. Keep sleeping on me. Keep uh, sleeping. Yeah. I done been through the struggle. I been through the pain. I done been through a lot. But you see that I changed. So keep sleeping on me. Keep sleeping. Yeah. Keep sleeping on me. Keep sleeping. Uh, yeah. Respect is given. I take it. Being great's in the making. My lyrics hot. You would think I was in the booth with Satan. Dealing with opposition. No opposite in position. Speaking facts. Never speaking fiction. My focus is to get it. Spread the word. Give it to them, homie, if they ask or not. Like Walker, I am flyer than your favorite astronaut. Circle small, super small, you would think my circle died. Child time with the word, Adam ate my Apple Watch. Keep it real, never being sketchy, never did respect me. I'm a king like I'm Elvis Presley. Snipe you like I'm Wesley, seeking blessings. Raised in the hood with a click. Mama had to be a dog, she raised a house full of pits. Taking risks, I always told the word, never shoot and miss. Move quick, my brother, keep up for my brother and my sis. I can't resist. If you're broken, I'm a fixture. I'm off the Richter, I'm different. I paint a picture with scripture. I done been through the struggle, I been through the pain, I done been through a lot, but you see that I changed, so keep sleeping on me, keep sleeping, yeah, keep sleeping. Yo. Hey, what's up everybody, welcome to another edition of Walking His Wave Impact Voice. I'm your host, Furman Jazz, broadcast to you live once again from my hometown of Mobile, Alabama. I was just playing on one of King James' songs, Keep Sleeping. If you never heard of him, that was uh, one of his songs that uh, he sent to me. So everybody get a feel, get a vibe of who King James is. He's from the Cedar Atmore, Alabama, and I got him on the air right now. King James, man, welcome to Impact Voice. What's going on? What's going on? Man, what's going on with you, my brother? Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you taking time out oh, yeah. to, be, to be a part of the broadcast. I know you're a busy man. I know you yeah. got a lot of projects going on. Uh, I know you have a new album coming out um, still here. We're going to get into that. Uh, but I want man get everybody get to know who you is. My first question is, who is the man behind King James? Who is the man behind King James? First of all, I'm just a servant of God, number one. I'm a, a proud dad, number two. And number three, I'm a man with moral standards, and I believe in what I believe in. I stand on it. Everything I say yeah, is going to be flat out true. What I rap about is going to be the truth. You know, just a straight up and down person, normal, regular, like the lad, joking play, you know, just a normal guy. That's all. That was a down to earth, humble, and and that's what we all, that's what we have to relate to uh, in our generation that, you know, you're in the platform on the stage, you're doing music. And let everybody know that you're real, because I know you're all about bringing life to dead situations. And um, I know you grew right. up in Atmore, Alabama. So what was your experience growing up in yeah. Atmore? Atmore, Alabama is small, but it definitely, when I was growing up, it was full of love. Most of everybody was in the same situation. Nobody really had much. So we all just really had these other. So it was just a lot of fun, sports, and, you know, just living. It's small, like I said, so if opportunities come, like, it's rare that you have different opportunities, but like I said, through Christ, through the mud, through the pain, through the hurt, through whatever we went through, we still find our way to the top through Christ. We still ain't there. We still working. We still working. Still got more. And that's what's up. 
I know that's, I agree with you 100%. We all are working and making. Uh, we're striving yeah. to get there. Um, my next question is, what motivated you to become a music artist? I've been I've been uh, writing music since I was 13, but I started rapping when I was 16. But I started recording when I was 18, and I was doing uh, secular music then. But it was a, uh, one of my good friends named Sean Doe. He just taught me, like, through the process, I wasn't recording nowhere. He offered his uh, studio for me to go to, and that's the first studio I ever went to. But I just sat back. I'm a, I'm a real big observer. I pay attention to everything. And I saw how hard he'd be going, how he'd drive. He'd do song after song after song. And when I was in there, he'd tell me, like, man, you got to always be ready. You got to always be ready to write no matter what it is. So that was a good quality that was instilled from the beginning. But, like, music is a release to me. It's like counseling. It's my form of counseling. So when people say you need to go see a counselor these type of things, music is my counseling. It's my been tool because it's things that I rap about that I'm too tough won't even talk about. But that's why if you listen to From the Street to the Church, Born One, and then this album Still Healing, you're going to see the progress because I'm opening up more and more. Each album, I'm opening up more and more about stuff I would never talk about or even bring up for real. But it definitely, mm-hmm. you'll see it in the music. You'll hear it in the music, though. That's what's up right there. And my next question is, do you call your music, do you call your music life music or Christian music? Definitely life music because uh, when you look at the word, just throw Christian music in there, it put it in a, a box and it take mm-hmm. away from the form, the art that, that you're giving out because if I'm rapping about just Christian music, I wouldn't be rapping about a, a song based on me being hurt. You know what I'm saying? Impaired relationships. Mm-hmm. But we know these these are uh, situations we go through in life. And to rap about situations are what we're here for. God take us down tunnels and avenues to go down. And we make it through these things so we can help another brother. But if we focus just on rapping about the Bible, just rap, you know, just stand inside of a box, you take away from the experiences that you went through in life. You never put your experiences in the trunk. You keep them in your pocket, so when you got to pull them out, people say, okay, you did go through this. You can tell me something. But I call it life mm-hmm. music because, like, it's it's focused on different categories of life, period, not just one thing. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of right. people go through relationship problems. They go through family problems. They go through uh, financial problems. Like, these are, th- these are topics that we can talk about. But when you get to putting a title on certain things, you put it inside of a box. But I rap life music mm-hmm. because everything I'm rapping about is my life and things I done seen and, you know, things I done been around. And it's real life. That's why on my shirt I got, you can't fake being real. And mm-hmm. that's why my name on Facebook is being real because everything I do is straight up and down, 100% truth. I can't, I ain't fabricating nothing. It is what it is. I went through it. I'm not ashamed of it. You feel what I'm saying? And the mm-hmm. main part of it is this. The main part of this, I'm not a traditional person. I'm not a traditional Christian where it's, I'm in a box. I do what I feel, what God put on me to do, I'm going to do it. No matter if it, look, it seem right to the other Christian, no matter if it's, you know, like everybody else doing, because I'm not everybody else. Everybody telling is different. Jesus won't walk around saying, I'm a Christian, listen to me. Okay, I'm over here in uh, this area now. I'm a Christian, listen to me. He wasn't parading that. He's just doing his works. You know what I'm saying? Don't believe the words, believe the works. Pay attention to it. You got to know it's God. Four hours in a year, who doing that? That's God. God give it to me. He gave it to me, and it, and it comes. You can tell when you hear it. It's you definitely got to know it's God. It ain't me. I know I ain't good like that. I ain't. I'm just a simple dude from Atmo, man. I ain't lying. But you hear the music, you're like, nah, he talking about something. Experience it. And I listen. Obedience is better, is better than sacrifice. That's true. And I agree with you. And, I, and also with your experience, I know me and you, no outside men, whatever you want to call it, we're in a different field mm-hmm. of being officers. And I know does that also play a role um, within your music? I know you see a lot in your line of work, just like I see a lot in my line of work. So does that mm-hmm. also play an effect? Man, like, my lifestyle, how I was living, I was headed to prison. My daddy was in prison. So I was headed to prison. But God snatched me up. He said, all right, I'm, I'm going to use you a different way than this prison stuff. 
So he had me working inside of prison. That gave me a different outlook on life. I, I looked at things totally different when I started seeing the conditions, when I started seeing people get killed, when I started seeing people hanging themselves. Like, man, that's a whole different, that's a whole different world. And it, and it put a whole different concept in your mind of appreciating life, appreciating freedom, appreciating just going outside, sitting on the porch, just breathing fresh air or drinking fresh water. It makes you appreciate all of these things way more when you're seeing the conditions that are going on in there. It's, it's to, man, it makes you get a total, totally different outlook on life, especially when you're going on a tunnel of going there. It makes you hit them brakes. Matter of fact, it makes you jump out the car. Forget breaking. <laughs> uh, hey, I agree with you. I agree with you. Yeah. I agree with you. Right, and right. I know you. Uh, I know you stated. You, I know you dropped in four hours. I know you stated it earlier, and you're doing ten videos yeah. of this year. Yeah. Uh, what message you want the listeners and viewers to get? Because I know you're doing life music, and I know you you yeah. deal, you know engaging those who going through everyday struggles. So what message you want to yeah, get right. to the listeners and the viewers? First, first, I want people to understand that God is first in everything I do. God got to be first in everything that you do. He should be first in everything. Number two, I want to show people my diversity, that I'm not a mediocre rapper. I'm, I can go deep. I can go left. I can go right. I can go up. I can go down. I can go sideways through Christ because God gave me this talent. And I'm using my talents. They're like in the Bible. I'm using my talents. So I'm showing. But the main thing is obedience. God told me to do it. I got to do it. It ain't no other way around it. So I I really want people to understand that no matter what your goals are, no matter what you have set forth in your life, with God first in it, all things are possible. All things are possible. But through the music, I want people to see that you are not the only one that's going through pain. You're not the only one going through struggles. You're not the only one going through anxiety. You're not the only one going through depression. You're not the only one going through losing family members, losing friends, losing jobs, losing everything that you love. Like on the, from the street to the church album, I got a song called I Just Lost the One I Love. Every album you're going to hear me talk about my grandparents. And though I say about counseling, when people say you need counseling, God is my counselor. Because no matter what a person say, you cannot change the fact that I lost my grandparents, the one I love to death. You can't change that. So only God can help me through that. You know what I'm saying? The, way the, song, the album is called Still Healing. You always, you forever healing. You feel what I'm saying? No matter what you go through in life, the thing that you go through, it helps build you to the person that, who you are. But you're still healing from it regardless. Because when something happens that triggers that emotion, you're going to think about it. So if you never think about it, you're done healing. When you think about it, you still heal it. That's true. Yes, and that leads me to my next question. You stated the significance of the album still heal is deeper than words. Explain to the listeners what well, that means. It's, it's, it's deeper than words because, like, on this album, I got 20 songs. God told me to do 20 songs. My grandmother was 20 years old. I, I was 20 years old when my, when my grandma died. And he, God told me to charge twenty dollars for the song, so twenty, twenty, twenty. It, it's a connection through it, but the whole thing is a full circle. Everything is a full circle when it comes to life. And like I said, no matter what you're going through, you're gonna be still healing from pain. You're gonna still heal from depression through whatever you go through. And you got to know that you are not the only one that went through it. You're not the only one going through it, or you're not the only one they're gonna get to go through it. It's it's a, it's a process. Still healing. It's a, see the whole. It's always life is a process. You know what I'm saying? That's why the Bible says, "Those who endure to the end shall be saved." It say endure. Mm -hmm. It didn't say you get you mm -hmm. complete. You complete it. It said when you endure to the end, you shall be saved. So life mm -hmm. is just a process. You know what I'm saying? And through it, you're gonna go through the happiness. You and you're gonna go through the pain. You're gonna go through all emotions. But the ones who hold on to the end, the ones who are gonna win. Just got to hold on to God because through him, all things are possible. You cannot miss with God being first. You won't miss at all. You cannot miss, man. You would not and I agree with you all. 100%. I agree with you 100%. Mm -hmm. I know the album still healing. Um, I know it comes out next month. So explain to the list of what day it come out and how can they purchase the album. See, and that's another significance of the album. It drops on my birthday, July 30th. You know what I'm saying? Like, every year I'm planning on doing an album. I'm dropping on my birthday every year. 
and they're going to be on all uh, platforms, iTunes, Spotify, you, uh, it'll even be on YouTube where you can stream it for free. Uh, these are uh, anything. It's on everything, for real. But mainly the main uh-huh. one I, I talk about with is Spotify, iTunes, and all of them, but it's going to be on everything, though. But this album is, ooh, it's different. It, it's different. And, I, of course, I got I got features on here. My, uh, okay. My Born Wonder album I had, well, True Seeker was on the feature. This one I got uh, True Seeker, Justin Carl Willem had the Vine purse, trying to get uh, J.B. Gosson on uh, Young Preach, uh, Boy Gospel. Uh, man, a, a number of people, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, like even on this album, I wanted to reach out more and show more love and, like, spread my wings and let people know that we are all in this together. It ain't just me, God first, in the ENT. You know what I'm saying? God first ENT is a movement. It's all of us. So God is first in all our lives. So all of us got to be God first ENT. You know what I'm saying? God first entertainment. That's what it means. And that what we that's what we put in the front. And you know he he first. You know what I'm saying? But the album is definitely a listen. It's it's something to listen to. I guarantee you it's something to listen to, man. For real. And I and I take your word for it. I know you're a young man, you're thirty one years old. And I ask everybody this question that be on the broadcast. What legacy King James want to leave? What legacy King James what now? What legacy uh, King James want to leave? Oh, what legacy I want to leave? Yes, sir. Well, I want to leave, like, when, when my eyes close and I rest, I just want everybody to be able to say this right here. No matter what this man went through. No matter how hard life got, no matter the ups and downs, no matter what happened, this guy always put God first. This guy always took care of his kids. This guy always, this talent that God gave him, he always used it to the maximum amount. Always. I just want to leave that. I always gave, gave everything my all. I don't take shortcuts. I believe in loyalty, honesty, respect, and truth, like like solid things. I believe in these things, so I do not take shortcuts. And like I said, I just want to leave some music, my spirit here, to know that I'm a living proof, man. I came from nothing, man. I came from a house. We were staying, we allowed them to 15 people deep staying inside of one house. You know what I'm saying? Nothing. When it, or when it rained at night, we had to get pots to put down because the roof leaked everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Never had central heater out until I turned 18 years old. You feel what I'm saying? When it's cold outside, we had to go out. My dad, me, my cousin had to go outside and find wood to put in a, a, a heater to warm the house. Had to open the stove to warm the house. Every day we eat bologna. Next day, hot dogs. Next day, bologna. Next day, hot dogs. You feel what I'm saying? But mm-hmm. you start from these things. That, that stuff don't make you. It builds you. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it just builds you to be a better person and to want more. Because at the end of the day, anybody can give up and then it's over. Or whatever the case may be, you can give up and just keep going down. Or you can keep on pushing and striving and have more in life. Because tough times don't last. Some people do. That's tough true. Tough times don't last. Um, some people do. That's true. And I agree with you. And um, I know you're a man on a mission, a man on assignment. And you're doing uh, yes, mighty great things. And you still on this, you still on the uh, – the battlefield, you still grinding, you still putting in work, mm-hmm. and by your heart, you love doing what you're doing, and I commend you, my brother, yeah. keep you know, putting in work. A lot of guys yeah. that's on this path, they phase out, but you mm-hmm. still, and, me, and like you, yeah. True Seeker, and me and others, man, y'all still yeah. going forefront, man. Y'all keep doing what y'all do. Yeah. Appreciate it. Appreciate that. Awesome. I appreciate you too, my brother. Like, we got 11 minutes left on the um, broadcast. So, uh, King James, you have mm-hmm. any final remarks, anything the Lord put in your heart to share with the listeners? I, w- I want to say this. Like, when you listen to the music that God gave me, please do not get caught up in the beat. Listen to the words that I am saying through Christ. Listen to the words. I'm telling you, you'll get whatever the message is supposed to be. You'll get it. I know you want to bob the head and it sounds good. Listen to the words, man. I got a song called I Just Need Some Time. And I say on the song, I say, late nights can't sleep, asking God where my angels at. Praying for some peace, asking God to bring my angels back. Man, I'm losing sleep, like I'm sleeping where some strangers at. 
I'm just being honest. All facts with no strength attached. I just lost the one I love. It ain't no change in it. Cause some friend loose I had to change while I was hanging it. Still healing. Patching up my feeling. What a doctor's it. I just need some time. What the watch is it. You know what I'm saying? Like, with, if you listen to these things, like every album, all my music, you're going to hear the pain. Because that's what I go through. That's what I've been through my whole life. You know what I'm saying? Most of everybody dealt with crossed me. Most of everybody dealt with hurt me. And I lost some of the most significant people in my life. So it can't, that can't be replaced. But what I lost, I can implement God in it. I can implement love in it. I can implement, you know, telling others how I feel and helping them through it when they go through these things. Because that's what we go through it for. God don't take you down no tunnel that you ain't built for. He said he won't put too much on you that you can't bear. He don't he don't take you down a no tunnel where he's gonna crush you. He take you down a tunnel where he's gonna build you, where he's gonna mold you into a stronger person, where you can help others because at the end of the day that's our goal. To to make it to heaven and bring as many as we can in the process. But no matter what you go through, suicide is not the way. No matter what you go through, giving up is not the way. No matter what you go through, God is the way. The truth and the life. And I guarantee you, you cannot, like I said, you can't miss. You will not miss, man. And at the end of the day, I'm, I'm not this superstar dude. I'm just a normal person. You can write me, I'll write back. You can talk to me when you see me. I'm humble, I'm laid back, and that's just my whole mode. That, like, no matter how far we get with this, that's, that's my whole goal to show, no matter where we go, no matter how far or how big we get with it, we're going to show people that you can, you're supposed to stay humble. You're supposed to stay yourself through the whole process. You got to be available to people because of some stuff that you went through that you rap about in your music, they probably done heard it and they want to talk to you about this and you help them through this situation. But if you separate yourself from that, you take away from your ministry because you can't help the person that's reaching out for help. And they might be on the verge of falling. They might be on the verge of giving up. But if your arms open, if your door open, if your inbox open, it's always helped us. So I'm always available for counseling. I'm always available to help anybody I can, no matter how old, no matter how young, no matter how, no matter what it is, say it or not, I'm here. And I guarantee you, God going to give me something to tell you that's going to benefit you, and it will benefit me <laughs> at the same time. Yes, sir. Man, that's what's up. That's what's up, and that's real, and that's from the heart. Mm-hmm. And once again, my bro, I appreciate yeah, you for being on Impact Voice. You're welcome anytime oh. to be a guest on Impact oh. Voice. I know you're a busy man, and I would love to get you back on. You now, when the album you ready yeah, to drop, man. love for you back on to talk about the album. Yeah. Um, and like I said, man, support uh, King James. You know, follow him on Facebook. Um, what outlets mm-hmm. or other outlets of um, King James they can follow you on for the listeners? They can know get in contact with you. On Facebook. You can follow me at Ben Real. That's B E E N Real R E A L. On uh, Instagram, you can follow me at Ben Real from day one. That's Ben Real, the number four R M, day and the number one. And you can follow me on there. And two, make sure y'all come out and support the uh, award ceremony in September. You know what I'm saying? I'll be posting it on my page. Make sure y'all come out and support that. You got two nominations on there. There ain't no more God. Thank God for that. And, you know, just support everything that God got going on. Because if he got somebody doing it, it's beneficial. It don't matter if it's three people come. It's beneficial to somebody, one of, one of them three people. So support it mm-hmm. and help push it because through Christ, we can help change things if we open our arms up more. And, again, mm-hmm. I appreciate you for even reaching out and for us to get together for this, I definitely appreciate that because you didn't have to, you didn't have to, period, you didn't have to waste your time with it, you didn't have to even think about me at all. So I appreciate that from the bottom of my heart as well. Well, I appreciate you, my brother, because I feel the same way because I'm glad you accepted the invitation because you didn't have to do it yourself, but oh, yeah. you took time out because it showed mm-hmm. me you wanted to do it, you're willing to do it. So that means a lot to me. Mm-hmm. Also, we're going to have a replay up too. So just in case you missed it live, the replay will be up. I'll be sending you the uh, replay. Uh, King, you can post on your page for uh-huh. the listeners. They can go back and listen to it. 
and um, things of that nature. Mm-hmm. We're about to ready to close it out. I'm about to get ready to play of Keep Sleeping. So if you missed it earlier, I'm about to play it again for everybody to check it out. So I want everybody to have a great weekend, and we'll see y'all next week. Peace. Uh-uh. Peace. Yeah. We back, man. God First Entertainment. Born winner. Let's do it. Mama was claw, I went through withdrawals, hoping I won't fall, dodging death like I played on salt. I just scratched and clawed to the top. I was steady climbing, I was steady grinding, digging deep like a surfer diamonds. I'm just saying, Simon, I bet Simon said. Mama called me Teddy, slept on me like beds, liver sick, like they out the meds, hanging off a ledge, I stack paper like TMT. They ain't seeing me and me. Well, I guess they are, cause they watch me like TMZ. Yeah. Grandma died, but she off in heaven, ain't no need to yeah. grieve. Fast life. life, you would think I played on need for speed, speed. but that my past. So Lead a pass with past thing with last thing. I had bullets flying like they had wings. wings. I had to cut them snakes off and now my grass clean. clean. You say you hit main stop, boy, you pass green. green. I beat the truth and tell you what it is. Get to you fake, you can't fake being real. For real. I done been through the struggle, I been through the pain. I done been through a lot, but you see that I changed, so keep sleeping on me. Keep sleeping, yeah. Keep sleeping on me. Keep uh, sleeping. Yeah. I done been through the struggle. I been through the pain. I done been through a lot, but you see that I changed. So keep sleeping on me. Keep sleeping. Yeah. Keep sleeping on me. Keep sleeping. Uh, yeah. Respect is given, I take it, being great in the making. My lyrics hot, you would think I was in the booth with Satan. Dealing with opposition, no ops in position. Speaking facts, never speaking fiction. My focus is to get it, spread the word. Give it to them, homie, if they ask or not. Light walker, I am flyer than your favorite astronaut. Circle small, super small, you would think my circle died. Child time with the word, Adam ate my Apple Watch. Keep it real, never being sketchy, never did respect me. I'm a king like I'm Evans Preston. Sniper like I'm Weston, seeking blessings. Raised in the hood with a click, mama had to be a dog, she raised a house full of pits, taking risks, always told the word, never shoot and miss, move quick, my brother's keeper for my brother and my sis, I can't resist, he get broken, I'm a fiction, I'm off the Richter, I'm different, I paint a picture with scriptures and lyrics, I done been through the struggle, I have been through the pain, I done been through a lot, but you see that I changed, so keep sleeping on me. Keep sleeping, yeah. Keep sleeping on me. Keep uh, sleeping. Yeah. I done been through the struggle. I been through the pain. I done been through a lot. But you see that I changed. So keep sleeping on me. Keep sleeping. Yeah. Keep sleeping on me. Keep sleeping. Uh, yeah. Let them keep on sleeping, man. Let them sleep on you. Make sure you give them some pillows or something like that for they can get comfortable. Because while they are comfortable, you're going to keep moving forward, keep striving, keep grinding, keep God first. You're going to win. W-I-N. We are born winners. We are born to win. Servants of God. Keep on moving. Keep striving. Keep grinding, man. Keep your head up. Keep striving for God.